Good morning, everyone. My morning's not so great. So I woke up early, went to campus to go to the UCLA Financial Aid Office, and on the website, it says their hours, and see, they even have a sign here. That's like, Monday through Friday, nine to four. So I came here, and then, of course, it's not on the website, but in person, there's a sign that's like, oh, we're closed on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So I walked all the way over here for nothing. Sad, I had a nice little stroll, so I'll vlog on the way back when I'm walking through campus again, because it is a really nice day, but I am very, very bitter about the fact they, they should have told on the website that during the summer they're closed on Tuesdays and Thursdays because it's a Thursday and I came for no reason. So now time to walk back and then I'm just gonna head to work right now, so. Yeah, struggles, but I'm gonna show you like some more campus stuff since I know you all love that and I've done that in a while since I've been on campus. But it's a really nice day and UCLA is looking real gorgeous today, so let's go. Okay, so I'm walking through campus like I said, so I was just in this hall, which was Murphy Hall, which has like, you know, a study abroad office, the financial aid office, a bunch of things like that. And this is one of the sunken gardens. There's one here and like one of there, so it's just like how it like sinks in. So that's what we call it, the sunken gardens. I'm also currently playing, you can't see it. The brightness is too low, hold on. Uh, up, it's actually at max brightness, but you can't see it. Um, you can kind of see. I'm playing Pokemon Go right now, basically. I haven't played it forever because there's no, like, Pokemon near my dorm for the summer, so I'm taking advantage of it now. But, alright, so to keep on walking. Alright, so we're in one of the most famous quads. So we have Royce, which is our most famous building up there, and then we have um, Haynes Hall, and then Humanities over here. So this is definitely one of the most like photogenic areas of UCI. I mean, UCI is gorgeous, but this is definitely one of the most. Like you have the green grass, like really gorgeous, like brick buildings. Yeah, I love. I have classes in like all three of these buildings, and then up here on the left, I'll show you. We have our library, or like one of like I think seven of our libraries. Again, there's Roy, super pretty. And then over here, like I said, we have Powell. Um, it's the most popular, I think it's the bit, yeah, definitely the biggest library on campus, but very, very nice. And I love our fountains going today. If you follow me on Snapchat at Italy you have seen that when I walked past here the first time, I posted a little snap from like the back of the fountain that like shows Royce in the background, which is super, super pretty. All right, so the picture I took on Snapchat was like a similar angle like this. And then over here is my favorite view on campus. Actually, I think my second favorite. The other one is looking on the other side, looking in on this side. You can see there are all the dorms back there. You can see just the really green, luscious part of campus. All right, I'm heading to work. So I'm gonna keep on walking. I'll probably give you a little more of a tour on the way, but I am heading to work now. So I'm going back to that side, which is what we call the hill, which is like the residence halls and stuff. All right, and you've seen me vlog this area all the time. This is Kirkhoff. We have like a lot of our student orgs in here, like student government, which I was involved with last year. Um, then you have famous Broom Walk, which during the year, it's just flooded with people like flyering and like advertising, promoting their events. Yeah. Then we have our Arthur Ashe Center, which unfortunately I'm always there because I'm always sick or hurt or like something happened. So that's really great. We have our John Wooden Center, which is our bigger gym there. We have the Bruin Bear right there. And then of course the UCLA store over there. Yep, and now I'm just walk continuing down like the beginnings of Bruin Walk and heading to work. Okay everyone, so Kelvin and I were just doing work. He's doing his physics lab and I was doing some YouTube stuff and Pacific stuff for voting. Kelvin and I were doing work and then we were just like, all right, let's go run and get some food quick. Either like, you know, Whole Foods or you know, go through In-N-Out drive-thru. But of course Kelvin mentions boiling crab. And of course we end up here because boiling crab. So I will keep you all posted with all the good food that we're getting. All right, we have the hair tied up, the bib on and everything. Okay, so like I was saying, for the Pacific Amuse contest, I figured out that you can actually vote more than three times today, I think, because today I voted five times. I'm, I'm not sure if it's been counted, um, but I voted five times with my Twitter and Facebook account. So you can actually do that. Um, so I hope you guys are doing that. I noticed that some people have been telling me on Twitter um, and like send, sending me their pictures of them voting and I'm following them and stuff. So yeah, thank you all so much for voting. I really, really appreciate it. But we're excited for all this food to come out. We haven't ordered yet, but we're excited for it to come out when it does. Amazing. Are you a crab? No. <laughs> Incredible. It's a thumbnail photo right here. Yeah, it is. It is. 
I know it smells so buttery today. Look at this. We have a pound. Oh, it smells so good today. It's extra gar it's extra garlicky and buttery today, which is just how I like it. I like it really buttery instead of oily. So we have that. That comes the same thing with a piece of corn. This is rice. We're still waiting for our. Speaking of buttery, do you know how to yeah. butter Cindy up? Vote for her in the Pacific Amuse competition. That was a great segue, babe. Thanks. I appreciate your support. <laughs> yeah, we're still waiting for our wings and fries, but yum! Ah! I don't know. And here are our wings and fries and ketchup. Let's dig in.